Rush Limbaugh infuriated millions of liberals with just two words. Rush Limbaugh is the king of talk radio. He reaches people all across America every single day with his pro-America message, and he just infuriated millions of liberals with just two words. There is perhaps no stronger defender of President Trump than Rush Limbaugh. In many ways, he primed the American public for Trump's tell-it-like-it-is messaging by speaking to middle America the same way for decades. And in a recent segment, Limbaugh explained that in his opinion, Trump was already re-elected regardless of what Democrats tried to throw his way. He uses the firebombing of an ICE facility by a radical Antifa extremist and the anti-America sentiments from the US women's soccer team as examples of why average Americans will not support the left. Breitbart reports. The point is, in their minds, they set their sights on somebody and they're able to take them out, Limbaugh said. They set their sights on Donald Trump in 2015. They've launched everything they've got. They've launched every weapon in their arsenal. It has bombed out, blown up in their faces. I think they're deranged, delusional, and bordering on maybe even clinical insanity here. With that in mind, Limbaugh said it was his view Trump was already re-elected. I think Trump is already re-elected, Limbaugh said. I don't want to make too big a deal about this right now. I think these people have gone so far overboard and they're unaware of it. There's a story in the stack about Trump supporters in Seattle coming out now. There's a story about how Antifa is bombing out in Portland. People are finally starting to see who Antifa is. When you see a story about Trump supporters surfacing and coming out in Seattle, I think there is. Megan Rapinoe did an interview. Come to find out, her whole family loves Trump. She is the only member of her family that doesn't. And she's mad as her Trump was criticizing her. Her father continued to love Trump. This point is sure to infuriate any liberal who hears it. But it is the truth. The left has gotten so extreme that President Trump should have no problem defeating them in 2020. If he can avoid making policy mistakes that would cause his base of supporters to stay home next November.